Hello, welcome back to the Freak Show, ladies and gentlemen. Bumpy McSquiggums here. We're playing with Kaya, or Kaja, or whatever her name is. And we're playing Elix. And we are... I'd, I'd like to say that I'm just going to sit here and I'm going to spend the rest of the day to finish up Elix. With all the recordings done in one shot, but that's probably not going to happen because I have no idea exactly how long that is going to take. But I want to. So just know that I'd like to. I'd like to put this one to bed, not because I want to be done with it and it's annoying. It's, it's not, actually. I, I'm really enjoying it, especially now that we're not super pathetically, horribly, overwhelmingly weak. Whatever this was, it was an impressive monument to the past. Yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be a thing. All right, so this is gonna be where we go when we find the part that we're supposed to go and find, and I guess where we're gonna go. Oh. oh, goody! I've upset the troll, haven't I? Oh gosh, I have. But only the one troll, right? The other troll's still cool. Hello? Hey. Count on me. I didn't just walk back into something. You probably shouldn't stand there and play with the troll. I'm just saying, it seems like a bad game plan. That's probably why you're laying there. I'm over here, Mr. Troller Troll. Oh, I didn't expect to step forward. <clears throat> well, you know, I, I survived a pretty much a, a Superman punch to the face from a troll, so I'll, I'll take it. I mean. I didn't have a choice but to take the Superman punch, but still. I'll take the fact that we survived it. And I'm pretty happy about that, honestly. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, I actually did dodge it. Yes, you shoot him with fire. I'm over here. Never gonna hit. Oh, good, you might hit me. Uh, and you're done. Okay, well, dances dances with trolls. I mean, that could be our, our name if we were named after what we do, but I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm not over, overly concerned with trolls at this point. I, I would like to find a place where I can cook, though. We're running low on our, our stew of uh, keeping me from dying, and we have to go fight one of these horrible bug monsters, or sorry, chicken monsters, which you know I'm a massive fan of. What's up, Terror Bird? Yeah, you knew the hit was coming. You knew it was gonna happen. You knew there was no way I'd get by fighting one of these without getting hit by it. So. It's amazing that it's still here. Yeah, you know, you keep talking about this place like it's something special, and I'm, I, I suppose in some way what it is. But did we ever kill the the Cyclops? I feel like we did, but I could be wrong. Wasn't he like chilling over here? I mean, I think this is that place. This actually looks slightly different than I remember it. Okay, well, wherever we have to go, it's beneath our feet, so we're definitely not to this location yet. And there's no telling how badly this is all going to go. Hello, anyone in here? Oh, yes, yes, there is. Hello, senor patron. Oh, that one. Ooh, he hurts. I should probably avoid letting him eat me. Oh, I'm stuck in a hole. Oh, look, he has a dog. Okay, look, he has several dogs. That's probably not great. Especially the fact that... Uh-oh. How, how are you handling it over there? Oh! Not very well, it would seem. Yeah. 
Oh good! The metal pole decided to prevent you from getting hit by me. Well, you missed. And you're dead. Alright, you can get back up. I mean, you're not really the best in a fight. I mean, for a magician, you don't seem to be magicianizing very often. I'm just saying. Like, maybe get on that, handle that, use your skills for something more than just laying there. Also, that has the wrong connotation. That is not what I, I meant. I meant don't just lay there in a fight. Like, fight. Like, actually fight. Don't just get hit and be like, Oh no, I am late tired. And then take a nap. Because that is not okay. Well, I mean, there's a way up. Not, not really what we're after. We're kind of looking for the opposite, you know, a way down. But, I mean, I, I guess we can go up. We'll just pick up a little sulfur nuggy over here. It's gonna be okay, I, I guess. Some more healing potions. We're running tests on the high voltage shield again today. I just don't get the focus on this solution. There are much easier ways to protect probes. High voltage has always been a proposition to protect the living cells. When I try and discuss this with the banner, I'm told to solve problems, not make them. Fair I play. Hope coming here with you about science. The reality is as bad as academia. Politics, politics, politics. Yeah. No doubt, buddy. No doubt. So this place is just going to be some giant, like, sprawling facility that we're going to have to figure out how to traverse. I, I gotta say, I'm not a, I'm not a massive fan of that. Oh, where are you at, grumbly dog things? Not good, not good at all. Found you. There's more, isn't there? Yep. I figured there'd be more. Actually, it does appear like there's several more, actually. Yeah. Well, we killed our way through the first few. No, I remember running through here much earlier on in the series, if you guys recall. And getting completely lost inside this place. Uh, up and down, down and up. Could not find my way to where I wanted to go or my way out of here. All I saw was potential treasure loot. And that's all I really needed to see, I think. It is very dark in here, but it's also very possible things want to eat me. I can't tell if there's things behind me, above me, below me. It is really hard to see. Okay, I can't do both. Alright. So we actually have to use the mag torch for something. Not really a fan. Alright, we need to find our way down. Still, obviously, that is kind of the ultimate goal here. Look out. Yeah, I figured as much. I think maybe the, the smaller weapon may may fare better and this small area I mean again could be completely wrong don't think that I am though oh that looks interesting also deadly also brighter than where we're at right now so if nothing else, I'm glad to be here for that reason, and that reason alone. 
Okay, small healing potion, some metal scrap. I mean, we're just getting a whole There's bunch of. Something wrong here. Something very wrong. The doctor banned me from his lab right before the breakthrough. I'm gonna call Laurie. I know that will get me fired worse if they find out, but, but Laurie is the only one I know who can find out what's going on. I, I believe in this project. Why are they hiding these results? You and only you would be able to answer that, friend. Alright, so there's some sort of project here. I think we're looking for, like, a part of our... Our uh, assault wing flying thingy. And that's what we're actually doing here. This used to be a, a science facility or some such thing. So this is where we're going to find the final piece. Ooh, there's a chest. That means I get to fail at the picking minigame again for the millionth time. Uh, no. No, of course not. No. 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 Oh my gosh, I hate it so much. Like, it wouldn't bother me as much if the mouse tied to... Okay. So it was the easiest one you could do. All the way to the right, all the way to the left. Of course it was. That makes complete sense. Like, it, it actually... It's just super frustrating, I guess. Um... Mag torch. Oh, look, there's another chest that I can't actually pick, which is depressing. Hey, some soup. I like soup. Uh, didn't I have something? Can I can I pick up the mag torch? No, nope, it ended up underneath. Didn't I have an item or something that allowed me to? Kind of. How many stats do we have now? Attributes. Just uh, probably a fair few. We have twelve. I'm not sure what I need yet. That's why I haven't actually done anything with that, if you guys are curious. Um, it's armor, isn't it? Thief cap. Not really going to do anything. High tech. Sunglasses. Nothing really is changing what I, I can do there. Okay, a ring of toughness. What are we using that right now? The ring of combat. None of these really help me a tremendous amount. This actually does a little bit with health and stamina, but but I lose a little bit of that attack power. All right, dexterity, experience, hunter, crafting, dexterity. Or we lose. Okay, crafting, bookworm. Survival, Friend of Beasts, Lockpicking. So we're going to switch to that, and now I should be able to pick this. Yeah! I thought I had one. This is going to be the easy one all over again? Nope. No. Okay, what if we go... There and then back. No. Oh, I don't like this. I never did like this, though, honestly. No. Eh. Eh. See, now it's now it's just being difficult. I want you and you, and then you and you. And then you? Yeah. A fourth one, and then this one? Okay, well, I don't... It's like there's two different lockpick mechanisms yeah. here. It's either this one, or this one gets screwed up. I can't get both, and I don't... Like, I'm not sure... So those two don't trigger right. If we go all the way over here, it doesn't trigger. I don't. I think I've done every combination. I, I don't. 
Hmm. It can't be. That's no. gonna see. It's gonna break. I, I've done every combination. What, what have I missed? I I just I don't understand. I, d I really don't get it. No. Like none of it makes any sense. Hmm. Now, if we go left, it's gonna it's gonna trigger down, right? Yeah. Like, what is the combination? This is gonna trigger down. Oh, I did that already. Mm -hmm. I swear I did that already. I swear I did that. Oh well, I'm losing my mind. It's fine. Oh look at that, an amulet of protection. We already have one of those. So I, I I'm gonna guess since obviously I didn't do that already. That was literally the last possible one. Of course it was. Okay. Yeah, no, that's that's fine. I swear I did that. Like, one of the first ones I did, in fact. Like, after the initial where I started realizing that that other one was triggering weird things. I was sworn, like, the first one I did was what we just saw. But apparently not. There are some bright lights here, I tell you that much. Bad feeling about this place. Oh, you do. The uh, remains of a long gone civilization. Yes, I, I, I'm aware that we're in ruins. Yes, thank you. I never would have guessed that without your insight there. Thank you so very much. Still terrified. I don't know what's gonna happen. So we need to go into the center where that weird glowing light is. That's at least one of the things that we have to do. There's going to be more. Of that we can be certain. We can be certain. Oi. Alright, I guess that's it. Alright, we've we've looted all the stuff. Let's get up here. Wow, dude, really? It's actually, like, what? Uh, hmm. Somehow it's now above us. I'm confused. But as confused as I am, which I am, I'm going to take my burning magnesium torch to try to utilize this before it, it peters out. Alright, so it's like, hey, right here, man. This is where we are. This is what we want to do. Oh, it's this. This. Okay. My bad. Uh-oh. Oh, God. The whole thing just moved. Am I supposed to be on that? I feel like I'm... Okay. Maybe the switch is what was being highlighted. And when we go down under here, we're going to find the actual thing that we need. It does sound like there's some nasty uh, things here. I'm going to go ahead and do a quick save. Because, again, while I'm relatively comfortable in our position of, you know, relative terrifying scary guy kill oh gosh almost anything that also means that what just happened okay don't hit the giant red barrels I, I suppose that's the lesson to learn in there there's definitively some really angry stuff hey Bye, Mr. Rotbore. Thanks for stopping by. 
All right, we're in a weird mushroom kingdom now. Yes, I want the Alexit. Okay. Well, I hope you guys enjoy uh, poorly uh, lit and very low visibility in your uh, Let's Plays, because that's what we've got here. Oh, look. It's another Alexit vein. She should be, like, thrilled. Sorry. Ugh. Elix. Well. Well, you dumb terror bird. I know there's something else out here. There it is. You did. Yep, we ever find a cooking fire, we're gonna have some roast chicken. Terror bird, whatever. All right, back to having some light once again. I think this place would be a little bit better glowed. Oh, that's what we're looking for right there on the ground. We have found our thing. Yep, the reactor coil. This could be useful. Yeah, no kidding. It's literally the reason we're here. Of course it's useful. Come on, man. Come on, Jax. Get some more stock lines when you do something. Why do I have a feeling like a dragon's gonna swoop out of the sky and eat us? Can I hack this? Uh, yes, I can. Wait. Uh, how does a number equal a number? Oh, okay. Which is great. Oh, that can't work. Two, two, one, three? The one is the only one that's correct. Alright. So, five, five, one, and then six, I guess. Five, five, one, okay. So, is it seven? I'm in. That's seven. Got a toy dinosaur and some energy drinks. Sweet. So some more mag torches. Some more Alexit. Some more memoirs. Electronic scrap. Hey. It's Dr. Adam something Dawkins. What's up, buddy? I see you there. Five five one seven. That would have been useful, but we hacked it. No big deal. All right, is this a dead end? And why isn't she like freaking out, going like, "Oh, Alexa or Elix? Oh, this is the place. Here, let let me kneel down and worship it, or whatever it is that she does." Oh well. Well, we did whatever we had to do here, so I, I we don't even have to go topside again. Honestly, we could just use our map and teleport. Alright, let's see where we're going to head next. Uh, we have that. And then we got to do something about heavy suspicion. Need to find proof of this, maybe. War machine. War of the machines. The converters are sucking the lands of the free people dry. They should be shut down. Yeah, I know. Now we know about... Uh, family meeting. Our father is alive. Maybe. You've learned that your father, Wardek, the Alb commander, has joined the Separatists. That was highly unexpected. You have to see them. Or see him. You might know where you can find Calyx. Um, I say we go do Heavy Suspicion. We're going to mark that on the map. We're going to find this on the map. Is it just talking to Zardom at this point? It looks like it. Alright. I'm going to go there. He controls an army of mutants, though. I feel like we shouldn't be upsetting him. But he was the one that shot us down? Is that is that what we're leaning toward here? We should go. It's dangerous here. Really? It just looks cold here. Now where is Zardom? Hmm. Wherever he is. This gives me a good chance to look through his things. 
there's a thing about Zardom's contract with Ray? Contact details for Ray. Research indicates he is capable of making the shot needed to hit the thruster on an Alb Raider. Zardom used Ray to shoot down my Raider. Really? Ray, Ray, Ray. I am interested to hear what excuse he gives me this time. Wow. I don't know. I f well, I, I, I realize he's supposed to be kind of emotionless. Like, I get it, but... I don't know, man. I don't know. It's it's a bit it's a bit rough to hear Jax's speech the whole time through, it's because you know, I mean the guy does fine for what he's doing, but I don't know. It just it, it, I want to say it doesn't fit the character, but it, it kind of does. I don't know. It's just something, and everybody's complained about it. It's just something kind of it feels kind of off. I mean, it's fine. I think we just go back to our our base, don't we? I think we just go back and we uh, go back to our um, was it right click or something? R to return to camp. Uh, I forgot what it's called. The place in the center, or Origin? I think that might be it. Let's go back to Origin and we talk to Ray there. I think I'll probably break off the episode once we load into Origin and the next episode we confront Ray and we see what all is going on. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and well, like I said, in the next we still have a whole bunch of stuff to do, but we're we're getting things done. We're be, we're being able to find the stuff that Status we. Status update. Valuable objects um, located, sir. Keep it up, you four. Thanks. Uh, like I was saying, we're be, we're able to find the stuff that we need to do, and we're able to just do it as opposed to really having to play around and like slowly try to approach it from multiple angles until we figure out how to do the things that we want to do. So I'm, I'm a fan. I'm a fan of uh, how far we've progressed. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that is neither here nor there. That is it for the episode. Until the very next one, my name is Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you for stopping by the Freak Show, and I will see you later. <laughs>